is Surface Studio. It's 12 and a half millimeters. It's the thinnest desktop monitor ever created, and of course it has touch. Now for $3,000, it's an incredible value. It's a product you can pre-order today. I now want to introduce you to this thing, the Surface Dial. The Surface Dial was created as a new form of input. The Surface Dial with the studio, there's just this magic that takes place. The really special thing about the Surface Dial is when we can change the color while you're painting without even picking up the tip, that's not just as good as real life, it's better. This is the most powerful Surface Book yet, by far. Here's the other thing we did, fairly simple. We put more batteries in the product. We gave you 16 hours of battery life, 16. I'm going to show you how we can capture this sandcastle with our Windows Capture 3D experience. Now here you can see the sandcastle is taking shape in front of me. Now there it is, I just made a 3D object using my real world for inspiration. <laughs> So I'm a huge interior design fan, and I absolutely love the fact that we can bring objects into our space and check them out before we make a big decision. I've got a couple bar stools here. Uh, this one looks good. I'm going to select it. And I'm going to place it right about here. Great. Let's see what a set looks like. I'm going to bring in a second one. And place it here. The ability to take a digital chair and break it free from the screen means that Taj can purchase with more confidence knowing that the chair will fit in his home. I am excited to announce that with the Windows 10 Creators Update, we are introducing Paint 3D. So here you can see I've got a photo of my daughters, and I'm going to go ahead and turn this into a 3D memory. And and you can see I have an option to share that on Facebook. And there is my 3D memory that I just created in paint, viewable on Facebook for all of my friends and family to see. And I can mix and match 2D and 3D content to illustrate my point. This would have taken me forever to find the perfect angle in a photograph. But with 3D, I simply rotated the tree to match exactly what I was looking for.